What's going on you guys? It is the Talking Sasquatch and we're back at it. So a few weeks ago, the folks over at Bank actually sent me a speaker to do a review on. So here we have it. It is the Bank Trivolo U. It's basically a wireless Bluetooth speaker that's set up for video conferencing. So let's go ahead and get this thing unboxed and take a look at it. And for our very first unboxing, we have the Trivolo U from Bank. Get this open. Eh, there we go. There we go. It's always a little bit harder with all the stuff in the way. How do you open? Oh, ah, forgot one. Ta-da! We've got ourselves a quick start guide. I'm assuming another quick start guide. Yep. More documentation, papers. Got a little USB charging brick. This guy is uh, two amps. USB-C cable. Mini jack to mini jack. Pop this guy off. Uh, here we go. Ugh. Anything else in here? Nope. <laughs> Bam! Little more sticker tape stuff. Let's see. Or I can just rip it off. That's easier. Alright, and here we are. I do really like the blue color. Um, it seems actually really well built. It's a nice, you know, a nice speaker, a nice piece of technology for sure. We've got in the back here, USB-C and the mini jack right there. And then controls on top. We have oops, kind of backwards. Ugh. Power, Bluetooth, looks like volume and the um, voice com and well, other stuff that we're gonna have to actually figure out how to use this. This is a genuine unboxing. I haven't even read the instructions yet. So once I get a chance to use this, I'm gonna check back and then we'll uh, do a full review. So obviously this is a little bit before the actual video. So hi, future me. One week later. All right, so closer look. Um, I do like the blue front of it. Speaker grill up front. We have subwoofer vents on the bottom. That's pretty cool. This actually does give a decent amount of bass, and then we have speaker grill vents in the back. So first and foremost, it is a Bluetooth speaker. So it's got three modes. It's got the music mode, it's got a video learning mode, and it's got a live learning mode. Now the music mode sounds pretty good. It's got decent bass. Um, it's a pretty good speaker for music. It doesn't get super loud. So if you're planning on trying to use this thing outside, it's not gonna be the loudest thing in the world. The video learning mode, basically it's um, got voice enhancement to try to clarify the instructor's words. So it's made for video learning. And then you have the live learning mode, which is more meant for uh, conversation back and forth. It has some leveling and things like that to try to make it so that, you know, you're not talking over each other. So you can select the different listening modes with this button right there, that guy. Also, if you hold that, it activates the voice assistant, which will allow you to change the volume or it'll allow you to change the different listening modes. Also, the button right next to it is a smart volume detection. So it actually has a little camera or IR guy on there. And what it does is it will basically detect where you are and the back background um, ambient noises and then select a certain volume and you know recording setting based on your surroundings. So some of the dialogue prompts that they have on here are a little hard to understand so we'll choose safe volume. Safe volume is on. Safe volume is on. I mean, I mean it's not really that big a deal. Now Trivolo U also has a um, iOS or Android app and you can use it to you know, see what the charge level is, you can uh, change the different audio presets and you can even create your own. It's got about a 12 hour battery life depending upon usage scenarios and you can charge it apparently up to about 80% in around three hours via USB-C and the included charger. Now Bank did send me this product for free to review but they're not paying me for the review. So, I mean, try to be as objective as possible. It is a really good piece of hardware. Uh, it's sturdy, it sounds good. Again, I would like it if it was a little bit louder. So if you were listening to music outside, it'd be a little bit better. But yeah, it's a pretty good speaker. Now the main downside is the price. It's a $209 speaker, which is, I think, a little bit heavy for what it does. So that being said, if you need a standalone voice conferencing system, it's got a you know good microphone, it's got good sound quality, it lasts for a long time, this may be the direction to go for you. So yeah, that's the Bank Trivolo U desktop dialogue speaker. Um, if you're interested in one, link down below. 
Thanks so much again to the folks over at Bang for sending one my way. I appreciate the opportunity. I've got some other cool stuff coming up too. I've got a ESP32 with a seven inch TFT screen. We're gonna build that into something really cool. Thanks again for watching. We're gonna catch you next time.